Thank you for watching, liking, commenting, sharing, and subscribing right now. Hey YouTube, or you watching me on YouTube, or in some kind of video embed from YouTube. You know what YouTube is, right? Hopefully you do. Unless, of course, you're watching this 100 years from the time that it's recorded and no one knows what YouTube is, because even my parents know what YouTube is. The first video that I recorded on YouTube, well, it wasn't really on YouTube, but I uploaded it to YouTube, ended up making it to the front page. It was the airline safety video. Uh, a lot of people uh, still watch that, even today. It's kind of nutty. Uh, I, I've been recording digital videos for quite a while, ever since I was able to. It's a lot of fun to do. I, uh, you know, first looked at YouTube as this, uh, just yet another place to put videos, and realized pretty quickly that there was a, a big community um, just waiting there, sitting there, engaging each other on YouTube. I'm like, I'd really like to be a part of that. I'd like to be able to meet people through YouTube. I would like them to know who I am and the things that I enjoy, and then we can share each other's experiences and, and go back and forth and back and forth. Um, you know, some of my first efforts on YouTube were compilations of submitted video questions uh, submitted by you. Uh, I had a, a, a slight uh, problem with the production process since I was doing it myself. And if you go back and watch some of the first videos that I put on YouTube, you can see that they were a little rough around the edges. I was doing my best, and that was at a time when I had just moved into this house. It was before I had this entire setup, and certainly it was before I started live streaming. And then if you watch the progression over time, uh, the amount of videos that I was able to put on YouTube uh, increased dramatically when I started doing live streaming because suddenly I had this live virtual audience. And right now, uh, on uh, Black Friday, I'm going out to approximately 600 of you all around the world watching me produce live uh, this particular video. And yes, it's about YouTube uh, because it's about this book, YouTube, An Insider's Guide to Climbing the Charts. And uh, it's written by, uh, I, I guess, a couple of people who have been engaging the YouTube community uh, for, for quite a while. Uh, Alan Astufka, and I, 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 you'll, I, Alan, you'll have to pardon me if I didn't say your last name properly. He says he's been one of the top 100 most subscribed comedians on YouTube with more than 3 million total views and has been featured on YouTube's main page multiple times. He runs a popular independent publishing project in Chicago. And Michael W. Dean directed the film DIY or Die, How to Survive as an Independent Artist. Uh, and he wrote the book $30 Film School, Course Technology PTR. He tours the US, U.S. and Europe extensively, lecturing on do-it-yourself, art production, and promotion. And so uh, this book uh, arrived in uh, my mailbox today, and I, I haven't read it, admittedly, but flipping through it, I think they've got some uh, solid suggestions, uh, you know, as, as I'm, uh, you know, looking. And I, I don't know if, if uh, I would necessarily pick up anything that I didn't already know or couldn't necessarily think about, but if you were thinking about really going deep into YouTube and understanding a little more about YouTube because you don't know where to begin, this is probably going to be uh, the book for you. Uh, there's a lot of pictures, and you know me, I love pictures. Uh, a lot of resources. Uh, there's a couple of interviews uh, with uh, some big YouTubers. Uh, they uh, dive into other topics and, and I, I, uh, things that I, I would certainly agree with talking about how to extend your reach. Uh, you know, it's not just about being on YouTube and engaging the community on YouTube directly, but it's about pulling people into your experience on YouTube. It's one of the reasons, again, why I like integrating chat inside of most of my videos. Uh, it's just a much more vibrant experience. It's less of a talking head to a camera thing. It's more than just a screencast thing. It's like an actual live, vibrant community inside the video as it's being recorded. And that is just, it's completely compelling for me. I just, I enjoy that. Uh, the caveat is that when I record videos live, uh, it's not an amazing experience. It's, uh, it drops frames, the quality is not amazing. Uh, I'm starting to get more into recording higher definition videos, not live. Uh, it, and then I, you know, certainly miss out on some of the aspects like chat. I may try uh, pulling chat up in a, in a larger experience on like one of my uh, notebook screens, facing it towards the camera and then recording it uh, that way, uh, just to try to have that, that live feel. Since I'm always streaming live, that's my angle. If I had an angle, that's my angle. 
I, I like to keep a, a regular production schedule. And they, they even recommend that here in this book, you know, be regular, be consistent. And I, I do my best. And there, there are certainly times when uh, I do something that's a little out of the ordinary. And I know I, I, I just, a lot of my stuff seems to be the same thing over and over again. Or maybe it isn't. I don't know. I can tell you, though, that we are, how many people shy of 50,000 subscribers on YouTube? I think that's absolutely amazing. I, it really is. That's an amazing number uh, for me to see. I mean, our live numbers are pretty strong. Uh, but I measure the success of what we're able to do on YouTube simply by uh, the number of subscribers. And it's specifically, this is where, um, you know, I'd like to see a lot more interaction with like video responses. I'd like to be able to get back into that again. I really would. Uh, because uh, if I don't, then I kind of have to reach sometimes and wonder, well, what are, what do people want to see? You know, for me, if they want to see anything at all, assuming they want to see anything. So I try to mix it up a bit. But you know, for me, this video is as much yours as it is mine. It's one of the reasons why I have chat in the video so that when it's unmoderated, we're able to, uh, you know, engage everybody. Oh, okay, so 47,713 subscribers on YouTube now. Channel views, that's the uh, channel, like, you know, my primary, youtube.com slash locker gnome. I think I'm up to like 33 million views on all the videos, across all the videos, and we've got close to 2,000 of them, really close. Uh, when Chris hits 50,000, what happens, Cat? It's a good question, I don't know. I really don't know. I think we should do something, though, when I hit 50,000 views on YouTube. I'll give something away, I'll figure something uh, out by that time or when we get really close. Either way, subscribe to the YouTube channel if you haven't already, uh, and certainly pass it along. Embed the videos. You know, even if you don't subscribe, if you embed the videos in your own blog or if you send them out on Twitter or Facebook or whatever, that's just as good. That's cool. And again, you, when the channel is unmoderated, can be a part of the video experience, either live as it's happening or potentially when it's being recorded. I mean, sometimes it just depends on how many people are in chat. I mean, we've got 600 people watching me live right now, so I can imagine there's probably about 200, 300 people in chat, and uh, that's a lot of people and a lot of noise and unfortunately we can't trust everybody so the more uh, often you come into the chat room the more we can trust you the more likely you are going to get voiced you know when you get voiced that means you can talk even when the channels mo whoa 336 people in chat dang it's a lot it's a lot of geeks but that's okay because i welcome all sorts of geeks my email address is chris at perillo.com but as i said feel free to follow up with a video message here as well you can send me a youtube email um i don't respond to very many of them because it's kind of unwieldy i know a lot of you guys are asking for product recommendations and advice the better way to get a hold of me is at chris at perillo.com you're also welcome to stop by geeks.perillo.com if you have a, a super technical question to ask i guarantee uh someone on geeks will know we're close to about ten thousand. Uh, registered members there at this point haven't hit that hopefully we'll we'll make both those benchmarks by the end of this year you know 50,000 YouTube subscribers 10,000 geeks that'd be nice I'd like to celebrate that before the end of the year you're also welcome to stop by the live video site uh, it's easy to do and when you do and again we're on moderated you can be a part of the live video experience you'll be sewn right in there uh, that's of course uh, you know well you know where it's at I mention at the end of every video and FYI, it is not mentioned in this book, but I'm still going to tell you it's probably going to be a good book for you to pick up anyway. Only $30. $30? Well, guess if you want YouTube, what are you going to do? I have no other way to end it other than telling you to stop by the chat room. We're typically talking tech 24 hours a day, seven days a week at live.perillo.com. We'll see you later.